Hey, this is Todd. I've got Charlie here. Uh, Charlie is a mixed breed, five-year-old male dog uh, that is in for board and train. I picked him up yesterday evening. And he's kind of funny. He's one of those mystery mutts. Uh, I could easily see him having some Airedale in him. Uh, the funny thing is the most characteristics I see are Yorkie characteristics. But he's huge, so uh, let's call him a Texas Yorkie. So, uh, I, what I liked about this dog so far is he's been uh, very relaxed as he came into the pack. He's not had a lot of stimulus with other dogs. Um, and he's not had a lot of stimulus in general. He's kind of been a, a backyard dog. Uh, but uh, the family's goal and wish is to have him inside and to do more with him. Uh, and that's a, that's a great goal and I, and I support that. Okay. But the tool we need for that is obedience. Charlie's, uh, he is a uh, car chaser. He is reactive sometimes to other dogs. So, but as I look at his face, even from just picking him up, I had a very open expression, open mouth, uh, relaxed ear set, uh, and he's just a dog that's ready to learn and ready to have something to do. Uh, so what I've done already is just a little bit of food conditioning with him. Uh, he, so now he knows the word yes means I'm going to feed you uh, a piece of food. You did something I like. Uh, the other thing I've done is some little, some starting collar conditioning. And he's funny because most of these terriers are pretty crusty characters. Uh, but uh, the collar that I'm using, uh, it's set so low that I would, most humans would not even feel this level of, of stimulus. Uh, but he feels it and he responds to it. So, uh, you know, we, we probably won't ever have to take him up very high at all. Uh, so let's just try him out. I haven't had him out here yet. And we'll see how he does for us. Come on, Charlie. Good boy. Good dog. Good boy. That's it. Yes. Good dog. Yes. Uh, I like about this dog that I can manipulate him and he doesn't worry about what I'm doing. So in other words, I can, uh, I can push it. Come here. Okay, down. I can touch him on the back and, and ease him into a down. And he doesn't care about that. He's trusting. Uh, some dogs are very concerned. You know, what are you doing? Why are you touching me? And he's just not like that. Down. Yes. So... Uh, and again, you know, I'm going to start these with food, teach the behaviors, and get them ingrained, and then we'll fade the food out. Uh, down. Yes. So, good boy. But I can tell as I watch this dog's facial expression, you know, the training is not stressful. He's enjoying it. So this is a dog where I'll be able to do, you know, maybe a 20, 30-minute session, whereas a lot of dogs, when they're, this is all new to them, uh, they get stressed, they start to shut down, their mouth starts to close. Uh, and I lose their focus, and he's just not going to be like that. So, come here. Good. Damn. Yes. Good boy. So, the other thing I want to know is how does the dog do with new stimulus? What Does it get worried? Does it uh, try to get away? What's it doing? And so, he's, he's never been on the place board before. He was very easy to get to do that. Uh, I'm going to move the camera and show you him on the wagon over here. And, and it was easy to get him to jump in the wagon. Come here. Huh. Good boy. Sit. Yes. So, this is a guy that wants to do some work. Come on. Good. That's very nice. So, well, anyway, that, that's mostly uh, what I want you to see, his first, his first session. Uh, and I think he's going to be a really fun dog to train. He shows a lot of promise to me. Uh, and he's got a great attitude. So thanks for checking with me.